Hey guys, welcome back. I'm me, DC Gunner, and uh, today uh, I was sent some straps, NATO straps from Bullshark. Bullsharkstraps.com. I'm sure you heard of them before. Uh, I I heard of them before, but I never got uh, opportunity to check them out. So today I got some straps. Oh, so I wanna check them out and share it with you. Uh, I have some watches here and I have something special here in the box uh, which I will reveal at the end of the video not right now right now I just want to show you some straps I got uh, unfortunately I only have these watches here today with me but I will uh, do uh, through my videos I will uh, find some watches for this strap and this strap I'm gonna put my orange monster on this one, orange one, but today I found these that work uh, with my watches. So uh, first of all, I wanna check it out and see the quality. Uh, this one, uh, they, uh, they are not all the same uh, what I got gathered. So this is like a Marine National strap, but I'm more interested not in pattern, but in quality. It has, it has a high polished hardware which I like. I like high polish. Some people do not, but uh, it works and it takes more effort and skill. It's easy to brush finish. It's signed Bull Shark. Hardware is very nice. Stitching is double. Uh, here, here, here I can see double stitching uh, all over the place. And uh, usually when I take this stuff, I'm looking for the stuff that's uh, really affordable. And these are all. Uh, 18 to 30 dollars traps so uh very nice uh the quality on this one this is smooth uh it's like a seed belt material so uh, i'm not sure it, uh, is that a thing but uh it feels like a seal seed belt it's silky and it's very uh, smooth on the wrist and this one is also a silky one on my submariner and i decided uh, i'm gonna rock my Submariner on some NATO bands. It's summer is coming, uh, no more winter. And I, I'm, I'm gonna use this watch, it's gonna be my beater. I wanna put some character to it. Uh, I'm not do I'm not gonna deliberately scratch it, but whatever happens to it, it happens. And uh, I like NATOs because they help uh, your Submariner uh, look like some run-of-the-mill Seiko and uh, for safety reasons also because lots of people know the mariner uh, steel band cyclops and whatnot but when you you see it on a, a nato band they're not gonna even give it a second look so it's one of those aspects if you having issues and you're afraid to wear your high-end watches and the big cities uh i'm not uh but i'm relatively in peaceful area but in big cities, it's a tank, and uh, <clears throat> I just like it. It is my old Mariner, and uh, honestly, 90s bracelets on Rolex is horrible. It's Seiko level, so um, NATO bands are helping. I was thinking about upgrading my Submariner to a ceramic one, but I kind of decided I'm going to keep this one because uh, I, I, I want to create memories and I already have some memories with it. So if I get a or it's ceramic one, it will be uh, not at the cost of this one. So I decided I'm going to rock it on this one. Kind of works. My bezel is already kind of getting grayish. Uh, so this will become vintage more uh, faster than the new ceramic one. So I kind of like it. I'm rocking Submariner <coughs> even on this one and it can it can work but for the purpose of this one i will roll in some photos but this is my citizen pro master and i think this is match made in heaven this is like a thumbnail photo here so uh very nice but uh this works on submariner and it makes it even more inconspicuous and not a second glance but definitely i think with the citizen uh, this is a great beater uh, for me for summer and of course we have a moon watch here and uh, this is uh, like a poor man ultraman oh my god with the orange hands and i kind of like this look also this is a silky band uh silky it's like 
it's like a seat belt material. I feel it's very sturdy. Also double stitching. And this has a brushed uh, buckles and stuff here. Materials, brush, blue shark. Uh, what I like is the double stitching and I like the price and uh, the, the orange one and I have orange and black one. This is not a seat belt material. This is general uh, normal nylon and the quality is very nice. It's like a ballistic nylon type of thing and it's very nice. Also has a double stitching and uh, brushed hardware on it. It's very nice and I like the I like the pattern of the holes. They're kind of square, not round. Uh, black one also works well on everything from Sitzen to Submariner to, uh, and it's not a silky pattern. To be honest, I prefer this uh, over this silky pattern, but sometimes it works, especially on higher end watches, silky pattern works. And uh, now I'm gonna reveal something here. Uh, I will not review this one or do it because this one is a bit more expensive and I want to put it to the test. I'm going to wear it. Uh, uh, planning to put this one on, and this is a leather band here, and I'm planning to wear this and I'm planning to put this one on my GLC. I have a nice reverso and you will definitely see it. I haven't been wearing it a lot. and. Uh, I want to see how it holds up because right now it feels uh, it feels nice. It's kind of stiff, uh, but I, in my experience, uh, all these leather bands are stiff in the beginning, and later on they become very soft as you wear them. Uh, I think this will work well for my reverso. I've been looking something for reverso. It says the alligator handmade. This is quite expensive. I will link you in the description box so you can check it out. So I want to reserve this. I want to wear it. And uh, in one of my next videos, I don't know, um, in the future, uh, if something goes bad with this one, I will report. So far, I can recommend all this because these are 18, 20, 30 bucks and less. And uh, this one's a bit more, so I want to test it out and check it out. So sometimes in the future, you will see an update on all these bands and straps. But for now, uh, that's about it. Uh, I would like to hear from you guys, which look do you like best? And uh, yeah, check out um, Blue Shark straps. They're kind of famous among the watch community, but uh, check them out, uh, tell them I sent you, and uh, see you in the next one.